I'm Ford Bell, President of the American Alliance of Museums here in Washington, D.C., and I'm pleased today to be able to salute the Oklahoma History Center, a division of the Oklahoma Historical Society, for its recent accreditation by AAM. This means the History Center meets the national standards and best practices for U.S. museums and joins the community of institutions that have chosen to hold themselves publicly accountable to excellence. Through a rigorous process of self-assessment and peer review, the History Center has shown itself to be a good steward of its resources, held in the public trust and committed to a philosophy of continual institutional growth. Accreditation is a self-motivated process. The Oklahoma History Center decided to see how it measured up to the highest standards of the museum field. I welcome the opportunity to share with you that it more than measured up and is now included on the honor roll of the finest museums in the country. The Oklahoma History Center has demonstrated its commitment to excellence in everything that it does, in its governance, its public programs, its strategic and financial planning, its collection stewardship, and in its overall operations. Of America's estimated 35,000 museums, just over 1,000 are accredited. That's 3%. And this elite group includes such well-known institutions as the Smithsonian here in Washington, the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York, and the Getty Museum in Los Angeles. All of us with the American Alliance of Museums Accreditation Program congratulate the Oklahoma History Center staff and volunteers, the History Center Director Dan Provo, Historical Society Executive Director Bob Blackburn, OHS Board Chair Bill Corbett, and all those associated with the Oklahoma History Center for supporting such an exemplary institution, exemplary in its mission to serve all the people of Oklahoma and the visitors to the state.